it's really just a group of people talking about something they really, really enjoy um, and finding new angles on it and finding new ways of looking at it. And the tutors you do try and put you at ease? I always come out of them and just feel relieved and like always realise actually just I spent the hour or two hours just enjoying myself. Well, the first word that comes to my mind is experts because they really are. Um, and it, it just feels like such a privilege really to be able to have a, um, um, to be kind of allocated an hour a week to have such a kind of um, intimate conversation with them, you know, just you, you and probably one other person and, and the tutor. Um, I think it's really um, important to stress how much tutors, how, like how different tutors are to teachers. Um, tutors are so personable and you can have jokes with them uh, and you can talk to them about things that aren't work as well. You know, at the start of every tutorial they ask how you are and I think they genuinely mean it and they kind of want to see that you're okay. Obviously they want you to feel comfortable to be completely open and just to to discuss everything that you're thinking. The breadth of knowledge is so incredibly broad. Like, it can be a bit overwhelming at times in tutorials um, because they're just so incredibly intelligent. And the great thing about about the tutorial environment and about having these tutorial people like the history tutors is that they always they always treat you with respect and engage with you as equals. Um, so you always end up having like, a, like it is a like it is a dialogue with these with these experts. Overall, I think I was most surprised at how friendly they are and how welcoming they are to students but also by their enthusiasm. They are just so genuinely happy to talk about their subject and they're so interested in it that it's really enjoyable just to have conversations about with them about whatever topic it happened to be. For my first tutorial, I was very nervous um, and I remember very clearly it was um, on the Brontes um, and I'd written this essay and you know I'd got no idea what it was going to be like and um, I remember waiting outside the room which was the same room that I'd been interviewed in so I'd kind of got flashbacks of the interview process as well. I was really kind of nervous that I was going to be asked to like defend my positions or um, that I was going to be kind of exposed um, but it really was not like that at all. Um, it was just a very relaxed, um, very enjoyable conversation um, about a couple of books that um, my tutor partner and I had read. And yeah, I remember kind of immediately afterwards, um, my tutor partner and I walked to a lecture and we were both kind of so relieved in a way, but also just kind of so ecstatic that um, this thing that we were going to have to do, you know, once or twice a week for the next three years. Um, was actually really enjoyable and like not the kind of scary situation that we'd imagined it to be. If you enjoy talking about your subjects, you'll enjoy a tutorial because that's really all it is. I would say that if you are one of those people who kind of puts their hand up quite a lot in lessons and likes to answer questions, um, you'll probably do quite well in tutorials. Yeah, I think equally, like, yeah, definitely if you're someone that likes putting their hands up in classes and stuff, then tutorials will probably suit you. But I think also, like, don't be put off if you're kind of a little bit shy, because I think tutorials are, like, a brilliant place for, um, like, people who think deeply about their subject, um, but might not, like, have the confidence to speak up in a big group of people, but, like, in a smaller group, it's perfect. <laughs>